Let's see how contents are published from OpenKM to WordPress. Here there is a WordPress blog. We create a new document. We put a title. It has to be an HTML document and once the document has been created we add content. As we can see, as an editor, what you see, what you view. We normalize line breaks and bullets points for lists. And to finish, we add a picture. We already have the content done. We save it. And now, to publish content, just need to add metadata. To metadata, you add a title, date, Content type, if it is a post or page, status, and it's synchronized, we indicate that the metadata are not synchronized. Automatically displays a message informing that the content of WordPress have been created. We can see the post, and if we go to the blog home page, we have the post that we have published it. The content can be edited again and will be automatically updated in WordPress. And if we update the blog content, we can see that the update has been successfully edited. We can also modify the metadata. For example, add a category and a set of keywords. In the metadata indicate that are not yet synchronous and this is what will synchronize metadata with WordPress to save. Here you will see a message indicating that the content has been updated. We can now see that in the post appear categories and keywords, and at the bottom we can see it too. Finally, we will see that can change the image. If we change the image that is in the past, we also be changed in WordPress. Here we can see that to the image what have assigned some metadata is available in media. Now let's change the current image with another. We can see that the metadata for the new image have changed. Preview and see the new chains, and if we go to the blog home page and reference, we see how this has changed.